Hey guys, what is going on? It is GTA Game here, back with another video, and today's video, guys, I'm going to be reviewing my first ever review, guys. I'm going to be reviewing the, um, I'm going to be reviewing the X80, because, like, I, I really like this car ever since it came out, but I've got, hang on, guys, let me just get away from that guy over there. I've got one or two, like, good things and bad things to say about this car. I mean, this this car's got some good points to it, but hang on, guys. Let me just get away from this scumbag. But anyway, yeah, it has got some good points to it. This car, but it has also got some like really bad ones. Um. Now, obviously, from the video, guys, one of the very first point uh good points you're gonna see is this car is incredibly fast. Whether it be upgraded or or just stock, really, guys. It is it is a fast car. Um, I've raced this car in uh, in many uh, stunt races. If you guys have seen on my channel, and some that I haven't actually uploaded, that I probably never will. Um, I've raced this car, and this car has it's it's either come second, third, or or first. It's it's a good car. Um, but weirdly, I actually lost in an upgraded one of these, I won in a stock one of these do with that as well as you will, I mean I don't really understand that but yeah I mean I'm gonna go through each point and say what I sort of think on the car in my personal opinion so the first point is the speed of it um, now I think that this car is incredibly fast um, I've raced it up against all the new um, cars, the Tyrus uh, oh, I can't remember the other ones, but the other two I've raced up against, and this car has always beaten them. Um, so th this car is incredibly fast. I'm not actually sure what the speed of it is. I think it's like I don't know. I've never really I don't know. I don't know what the speed of this is, but as you see on the video, guy, uh, now guys, it is literally incredibly fast. How fast this is. By the way, can I just say, guys, before we continue with this, I am literally shitting myself because this is the first ever car review I've done, and I'm not actually sure if you guys are gonna, you know, say, "Oh, you're cool, you're you're nice review," or whether you guys are gonna sort of insult it and say, "Oh, it's shit." But you know, I'm I'm fucking pissing myself right now. But anyway, let's get on with the review. But yeah, um, <laughs> sorry guys, but yeah, um, the, the speed is is. Is 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 very good. The speed's good. Another thing is 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 um is is it there? Ah, yeah. Sorry guys, my fucking speech is off today. Another good point about this car is is it is <laughs> I can't fucking say it. Is its acceleration? That's another good point. Um, its acceleration is like fucking brilliant. For the, yeah, I like it's like. It, 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 oh god, its acceleration on its own has probably helped me win a lot of races in this car. But there is two points about this car that are not good, guys. They're shit. The first point is its turning. Watch this. Look, look. No, not that. That was like a sort of a drift, which I quite like. Um, but look, if you're turning on sort of a thing like that. You, well, that was a bit of a fuck up as well. You can't really do it unless you're actually on a stunt track. I should have already done this video on a stunt track, not in the streets, because there's not no big turn corners for it. All right, hang on, guys. I'm gonna launch a quick stunt race, and while that's launching, I'm gonna basically, guys. What I was gonna say is, when you are turning on a corner, I've I've really done it with the stunt races. Is um, it it. Other cars sort of kind of really have good turning, they turn right into the corner. But with the X80 guys, it doesn't do that. It's sort of um uh I'll host it, I wanna be on my own. It's sort of just um oh, what's the word it Oh man uh I'll show you I'll show you what I mean. It it, it can't turn in basically. It's steering it is shit, basically, if you want my honest opinion guys. I, I don't like the steering on the X80, no way, because it is just, um, it's, it's rubbish. And I'll, I'll demonstrate that to you guys now, actually. 
But what, I'll tell you something guys, what it doesn't make up, what it loses in its turning, um, and the other thing I'm going to mention, it really does make up in its acceleration, its, uh, its speed, and probably its looks, because this does look like a badass car. I like this car a lot. I, probably my favourite car in the game is this. Fucking brilliant car. I always use it whenever I go. If you guys... If you if, if you guys ever, ever watch another video and you just see me driving this car and you say, why don't you use, use any other car? You all know why. Because I like this car a lot. But yeah, look guys, I'm going to demonstrate what I mean by... Look. Look. It doesn't... It... <sighs> I don't know what's happened here today, guys. You dictate, you're making me look like a liar. Maybe it'll come up in a, like another turn. But usually on the turns on these on these uh, stunt races, is the X80 sort of though it doesn't turn in right. It's turn it's steering is proper shit. But if the turn oh that was close. If the turning um doesn't work, I'll demonstrate the braking. That's another point, guys. The braking on this car as well is shit. It, it's got speed and thing, but it's just it's just shit with its braking and its um its steering. The steering and the braking is utter 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 useless on this car. I, I I actually tend to think it's probably better when it's stock than if it's um if it's upgraded because the upgraded is just shit. Uh, like the upgraded's good. It gives more speed, but it sort of shits out the um. Maybe that corner up there, I'll be able to show you guys exactly what I mean with this car. And you guys lucky, you get a review and you get to see this car race as well. On its own, but you know, still racing. Two videos in one? But I'm the first channel to fall with that. Hang on, look, 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 guys, that is a demonstration. That, it turns, but it's turning is pure and utter crap. Watch, look, ready? Look, I'm literally turning, look at the wheels, I'm turning it. Either does that, smashes in, if you can't control it, or it whacks that bit. And if you're at fast speed, guys, this is where, where you... Oh, this corner will show you guys, if you haven't already seen it, watch. Hang on, ready? I'll turn long, long ways, look. Ready, turn it, turn it, turn it, see? Now, any other car, if I was in a race and I was first, I probably would have just screwed my chances of winning. Any other car would sort of turn like this on the inside, but this car doesn't. And that, I think, is probably what's better with the Tyrus, because the Tyrus actually actually turns correctly, uh, but this doesn't. Maybe that's where the Tyrus sort of says to the X80, oh, you know, I'm better in turning and, and steering and turning and braking than what you are. Do you know what I mean? I will try and demonstrate the braking. Look, ready, ready, ready. Right, watch the braking. Braking's absolutely friggin' useless. You guys just saw the braking was absolute waste. Ready? I'm gonna turn. Uh, see? Braking. Crap. The braking's alright, but if you're going at a really fast speed and you have to slow down for a corner... Like, a corner like that is really long, and as you just saw at the end, you smash into the barrier anyway. But watch this. So I've got this corner yet. Yeah, look. Look how crap that braking is. That is how bad the braking is. It just does not work for this car. But I'll tell you what, guys. What this car lacks in braking and steering, it makes up for a hell of a lot more in its looks for a start, which I, in my personal opinion, think it makes up for its looks, and for its, um, its speed and its acceleration. This car... If you guys have 2.7 million and you're looking for a race car, oh that was sick at the end. If you're looking for a race car to um to drive, you know, if you guys um you know to uh the, you look at you if you've got a lot of money and you're thinking oh what race car shop I you know um definitely buy the X80 because although it's it's steering and it and it's braking is quite crap, it will always be the Tyrus, uh, the other two new DLC cars, it was always beat them. Or you will at least get a second or a third. But anyway guys, that has been the video for today. I'm going to head off and I'm probably going to play double loop on the new stunt jumps because I'm bored and I want to have some fun. Anyway guys, uh, this has been GTA Gamer. Don't forget to subscribe. 
don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you thought it was amazing. And this has been GTA. <laughs> fucking hell, sorry guys. This has been GTA Gamer, guys. See, oh fucking hell. My 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 vo I don't know what's wrong with my voice today, guys. Just before I go, my, I don't know what's wrong with it. I just can't fucking talk. But yeah. See you guys in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe. And see you in the next video, guys.